Greetings one and all, I am the Sonic Geek, and welcome back to the Pokemon Platinum Randomizer Nuzlocke. Joining me again is Shadow Samus. Hello. Now we need to do some grinding to take on the grass gym. Let's see. I think, first up, will be Kiku. Good thinking. Where's the XP share? Although first we need to find a good spot to grind. Through? Can't go that way. But you can go back that way. Yep. Let's see. Oh, you are dead. Oh, that thing is toast. Woo! Starting off with a dead right horn. Awesome. Ah, oh, beautiful. Sorry to any right horn fans out there. We're starting off with a Rhyhorn murder. And then a Kecleon. That Violet Plume should not be fighting a Kecleon. I will spoil that right now. Ooh. Much better solution. And that was on a crit. That, not so much. That's... Okay. Need the Oops. fire type. He is currently fire. He is now dark. He is now dead. He is now dead, but still. Okay, gonna go back and heal up. Probably smart. We've learned a valuable lesson here. <laughs> Your valuable lesson is watch out for those Kecleons. They yeah. have a wide variety of stuff. Yes. And you can't change them to ghost right away. Nope. Because they start off as normal. Yep. If only you had if only you had a certain other type of move. Then they would be pathetically easy. <laughs> what fighting? No. Dragon. Oh. You change them to dragon and then they're weak to themselves. Fair enough. Machoke. Oh, hello. And because Harvest is part poison type. Yep, you are quite good at fighting those things. So, so far, all we really need to watch out for is the Kecleon. I mean, had they not had Psybeam, it might have been a little bit better. But... And another it matchup. had Psybeam. Yep. Which is a little bit awkward. Yep. On the plus side, you do have a Sableye, and I believe those things are quick perfectly for fighting those Kecleons. It would be, yes. Precisely. Although it's not in the party right now. 
Eh, that's the only unfortunate thing. Oops. Alright, not terrible. What level's that balloon at? Uh, 16. Okay. <clears throat> it is a little ways away, then. I was trying to think of when it would have... It's good old Mach Punch. Well, Mach Punch isn't exactly going to be the most helpful thing right now. It's not going to be take as well. It's better than any other grass move that thing will have. Going up against other grass types. Fighting's not terrible, and besides, what if you run into a lily? Fair enough. Or a cacturn. Or a nuzleaf. Well, isn't that what we have gyro for? Another fortress. Well, Bug's just good on grass in general. Yeah. Of course, the only really pro real problem spot a Breloom would run into is if you were fighting a Bulbasaur. Or anything else that was poison. Yep. Don't I have the Versus Or, you secret? know, any... Uh, you do have the Versus Seeker at this point. There it is. It is right there. Actually, hold up. Let me... I love keeping that thing registered. Nope. They don't want to? Not yet. Just walk around a little bit. They might want to all of a sudden. <laughs> okay. You need to be swapped out. Bam. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Manectric. Oh, that is... I'm not sure how to feel about a Manectric being there. That is the rare catch. It's... I bet this would give some decent XP. Well, it is fully evolved, so it would be kind of decent. Those Kecleons aren't bad XP either, if you can fight them. Those are better, though. Woo! Too bad it seems like they're the rare catch. That was what level? Uh... Was it what? I so didn't... That was like... Oh! Oh, oh that is a Houndoom! That is a get harvest out of there. <laughs> That's exactly what that is. And here is his bite. <laughs> Which is still pretty solid. And is powered up even further now. Bunk. <laughs> oh boy. Um, um, um. Well... Uh, if you want, if you want an honest answer for, as to what you should do, keep him in there. That thing boosted its own attack. But not enough to kill. <laughs> that was a gamble. And I would say not even worth it. Not yet. Funnily enough, that Breloom, once it gets high enough in level, will be the perfect thing for fighting them. Really? I mean, they'll probably go down in one Mach Punch, so they won't be able to do anything. Fair enough. 
Once again, Lieutenant Gore narrowly escapes death. Of course he does! He's a tough boy. I think for the moment, I'm just gonna run away from any houndoom. Yeah, for the moment. A temporary solution. Another. And side beam. Did next to nothing. Now he's using Fury Swipes. Oh, uh, crap. Uh -oh. oh, no. Stop. Stop. Uh... Bye. I just started voting Keckley on to. Uh, for now. Now a moment of silence. Yep. Ah. That kind of sucks. I always keep forgetting I can't go that way. Yeah, that's... not down far enough. Times have befallen us. Mm hmm. We lost our only dragon type. Oh. We lost our first catch. Oh, that's totally right. He was the very first one.
He had Ember. He did. Which would have really helped. I mean, him being Dragon was a pretty good help, too. Yep. That's the first time I've made a mistake like that. Whoops. He's got Peck, right? He does. He okay. does have Peck. Uh, Not double kick for some reason? Or does he have double kick? No, he doesn't have double kick. Hmm, that's odd. Yep. It's a weird timing of catching him, I guess. Yep. <laughs> no. <laughs> Bad memories from this thing. If you had double kick, I would say maybe, but... Nah. Oh, he won't let me. You might be sturdy enough to res just resist everything from that thing anyway. Oh god. Oh! Well, problem solved. And it just used ROAR! Okay. Hello, Rhyhorn. Stomp. Does next to nothing. It'll just get healed back anyway. Yep. If not, if not from the sludge, then from the Mega Drain. on the other hand, does not care. <laughs> Take two. Yeah, just keep using Leer like that. Ooh, Foresight. Foresight. Now it's coming to the point where the Machokes can be dangerous. Yep. Potentially. Manectric. Ooh. Fun little fight against that thing. Yep. Oh. Still can't outspeed a crowbat. Of course not. There's not that much that can. How ironic is it that the fastest Pokemon is weak to electric types? Not really that... The fastest Pokemon's not weak to electric types. The fastest Pokemon's not weak to electric at all. Okay, the fastest normal Pokemon. As in, not legendary. Not really that ironic. <laughs> Them little birdies are known for being kind of fast. Ooh, another one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
Ooh, Thunder Wave. Oh yeah, that is a little bit of an annoyance. Yeah, you up that attack, Minetric. Much stronger quick attacks. <laughs> didn't what? work. <laughs> I just did not so good in my game. Oh. Oh well. You know, I think your problem with that Kecleon was that you were switching the Bagon into it. Now that I think about well, it. Well, I have no way to tell when it's gonna. Because they're random encounters. They are random. However, considering that however, considering that, that Vile Plume is not equipped to fight a lot of things on that route. I had a sharp beak somewhere. Guess not. Hmm. We got another place to train? I'm all ears. Uh, another place to train? The only other place I can think of that would be good is going back into the mountain. Okay. I forget what's there. But. Pretty sure that's where we caught Torchic. That is, I believe, where Torchic was. Oh, I forgot they had Spark around this time. Well, it didn't do a whole lot, so... Well, yeah. <clears throat> it did a little more that time. This guy yet? Yep, half. Pretty sure I haven't fought you yet. All right. So, what kind of trainer are you? I think poison. Well, we're not gonna know. You have you. I 
I don't care which one it is. That thing is toast. <laughs> that thing is very much toast. One shot. Yeah, goodbye thing. Woo! Protein. <laughs> How fitting that a black belt was guarding protein. Yep. Let's see what else we got in here. <laughs> the answer is... Bonsly. A Bonsly. Not as good as a pseudo wudo, but it'll serve our, suit our purposes. It will become one. Eventually. Well, maybe not this one, but... <clears throat> I mean, all you did was knock it out. It can come back. Technically. Yep. Oh, that is a Fero. That, that Fero, on the other hand, is not becoming anything else. Um... If you want the answer, only one thing resists everything that Fira could possibly have. This one? Yes. Yes. That I is knew. pursuit. Well, okay, now it doesn't now I know it doesn't resist everything that thing has, because it has pursuit. <laughs> well, thankfully we're switching into it instead of out of it, so. True. Well, technically you're always switching out of pursuit. Yeah, but. Jirachi isn't. Jirachi's not switching into it. Jirachi's not the one taking the hit, is what I mean. I mean, not that it would have mattered. It would have done, like, four damage. It only did more because you were switching. <laughs> yep. So we find Electric right next to the route where we find Manectric. That's funny. <laughs> Way to go, randomizer. Hey. Oh, look. Another toxic croak. Ah, uh, memories. Yeah, the one that lasted three minutes. <laughs> True. Shit, that, that would have come in handy here, too. A little bit. Poison stain. You know, it occurs to me we haven't run into another Torchic. Now that you Never say Never mind! It. Now that you say it! Peck off. <laughs> See, your peck did more. Your peck did more because of your massive level, but its peck was super effective. <laughs> <laughs> because you're fighting. <laughs> Ooh, victory bell. Hello. Hello, old time counterpart to the thing that's heading your party. This... Why didn't you burn it? I don't know. Psychic's, I mean, Psychic's amazing on it too, but still. Because I'm pretty sure Psychic does way more damage than Ember. Well, let's see. Let's see the math. Uh, Psychic is like twice the power of Ember. Psychic's coming from a fucking legend. Yep. Psychic will soon be not quite as strong as something that 
something that their combustion will eventually have when it's no longer a combustion. Blaze uppercut. Blaze kick. Blaze kick. You combine blaze kick with sky uppercut. <laughs> blaze uppercut. Well then. Very clip. Very classy. You know, for something that's poison and fighting, that thing sure has a lot of dark moves. Yep. I think after this one we're gonna go heal up. Good thinking. I think another reason I suggested burning it was because you only get 10 psychics. That's fair. As opposed to this thing, which has not only 25 embers, but also 35 pecs, which are good on it. I want to look at the stats real quick. I'll give you a hint, it doesn't matter what stats are, ember is going to be stronger than peck. Vine Whip, on the other hand, is not going to do much to you. Nope. Alright. Get back to the Pokemon Center. To see you again, you probably will. <laughs> Alright. So I'm going to call the video here. Thank you guys so much for joining us. If you like this video, leave a like and a comment. And if you want to see more, hit subscribe and hit the bell, and we will see you guys next time. Thank you for joining. Thank you for joining. <laughs> <laughs>